Hi, I am Warrant Officer 2nd Class Ali Salimi. I am from 759 Falcon Squadron in Burnaby. I am currently employed as a glider instructor in Comox Cadet Flying Training Center in Comox. So in 2011, I had uh, a summer vacation across the world and on the way back, I started really thinking about how it would feel to uh, fly these beautiful airplanes that just so elegantly took off and landed. It was uh, a winter night and I accidentally encountered a memoir by an Air Canada captain who uh, had said that they earned their glider and power pilot's licenses in Air Cadets. And within two days, I was registered as an Air Cadet and started really participating as much as I could in my local squadron. I remember in grade 10, I was participating in Cadets about uh, six nights a week, so I only had a day off. And I participated in marching band, I participated in ground school, regular training nights, effective speaking, first aid, and biathlon while also managing my academics and uh, keeping my school averages really high so that in the future when I apply for the Glider Pilot Scholarship, I would have a good chance of getting in. In uh, grade 11, I started really studying hard. Uh, I would say even overstudied for the entrance exam. And I believe I was told that I got the second highest mark in British Columbia and uh, made my way uh, into the uh, Glider Pilot Scholarship course. That uh, at that time was honestly the best thing that had ever happened to me. And um, I, I, I just fell in love with gliding and just being a part of the team in Comox. I found uh, the commanding officer, Lieutenant Colonel Stewart, as a very supportive man who truly cared about his job and truly cared about the future of these cadets that uh, come to Comox every year. And I, I just wanted to be a part of that team. My message as a senior cadet just about to age out to a prospective cadet in any of the three elements of the Air Guard program would be that cadets um, is a very, very valuable opportunity. It's almost um, incomparable to any other uh, youth program that I know of. Uh, and you don't have to be successful as a person or as a cadet by you know joining the aviation team. You can be successful as a musician, as a first aider. You can be uh, a successful uh, warrant officer or just any type of a leader in the Air Cadet program. And unless you join and really work your way and discover these opportunities, you will never know what has been offered and what is going to be offered in the future. Uh, imagine opening this door and finding yourself in, in a an inventory of opportunities that are available to you, that are readily available to you and you can pick and choose it, whichever one that you want. I have chosen the aviation way, it's something that I've been very passionate about. That combined with my perseverance has led to me being here and I'm sure that if another cadet anytime in the future or present uh, is thinking about doing the same thing, we'll also be able to not only learn a lot from the air cadet program but to acquire uh, a very vast amount of knowledge and in the future teach and give back to the aircraft program whether as a cadet or a civilian instructor or a CIC officer.